Oh, hello. Wow. Popular. I know about popular. Skeptics be damned. Ariana Grande has officially stolen the show in Wicked, delivering one of the most jaw-dropping portrayals of Glinda we've ever seen. Bold take? Maybe. But in my eyes, she's now the frontrunner for the Best Supporting Actress Oscar. Want to know how the pop star pulled it off? What the audition process was like? And why fans can't stop talking about her performance? Stick around! Because we're diving into this iconic role, and the scene we've all been dying to see brought to life on the big screen. I know about perfume. <laughs> the sound that this perfume bottle makes, I really need you to hear it. When Ariana was first announced as Glinda, the musical theater fandom wasn't exactly thrillified. This comment from 2021 sums up the fandom's vibe perfectly. As an Ariana Grande fan, I can't help but feel her singing style isn't suited for the role. Her voice is incredible. Yet, I don't think she'll be able to capture the magic of Wicked the actresses could. Feels like she was used as a publicity stunt. Ouch. But hindsight is 2020, and now that audiences have seen her in action, reviews are glowing. Billboard called her a revelation, and many are already whispering Oscar buzz. Could we be looking at the performance of the year? Signs point to yes. Let's clear something up right now. Ariana wasn't handed this role just because she's a pop icon. This wasn't some quick cash grab to boost the box office. Grande had to audition five times to prove she had what it took. That's right, five. And why did she fight so hard? Because this role meant something to her. Ariana first saw Wicked at age 10, and it left such a mark on her that it became a dream role. Now, and since you're a Broadway girl, of course you must love Wicked. Yeah. Yeah, and and I'm sure that you have dreamed of playing one of the two roles. Would you be Elphaba or Glinda. Glinda? You'd be Glinda. For sure. As I kind of got wind that it was coming closer and closer, mm -hmm. I went to voice lessons and acting lessons and every day was trying to get ready. She poured her heart and soul into the audition process. And when the time finally came to announce her casting as Glinda, her reaction said it all. Need more proof that Ariana nailed it? Let's hear from the OG Glinda herself, Kristen Chenoweth. We watched the movie because she wanted, she was nervous, you know? She paid beautiful homage to, to my work, but she did her own too, yeah. very much so. And she looked at me, we were both crying. She goes, are you proud of me? Oh. And I said, I Stop. lost my mind. What do you mean? I said, I'm so proud. If Chenoweth approves, what more do we need to say? Grande didn't just step into the role, she owned it. And speaking of popular, Grande absolutely shines in her rendition of popular, putting her own unique twist on Chenoweth's signature song. Those high notes? Hair-raising. Her comedic timing? Flawless. With choreography, charm, and a golden era Hollywood vibe, Ariana balances subtlety and silliness like a pro. This performance is the moment fans will be rewinding over and over when Wicked hits streaming platforms. Trust me, you'll want to hit that play button again, and again, and you get it. One fan on Twitter summed it up perfectly. Popular by itself should win Oriana the Oscar. Not only are her vocal choices in that song so incredibly thrillifying, she was so unbelievably hilarious. My theater literally laughed at any little thing she did, and she got a standing ovation at the end. Chills, literal chills. Now it's your turn. Did Ariana Grande blow you away as Glinda? Is this your new favorite portrayal? And be honest, how many times have you played popular on repeat already? Drop your thoughts in the comments below. And hey, if you're new here, hit that subscribe button because we've got so much more wicked coverage coming your way this week. Want more? Check out Connor's deep dive into that defying gravity scene. This iconic number required extensive preparation, including Cynthia Erivo training for a year to perform the stunts and sing live simultaneously. 
Oh yeah, you heard that right. Our girl did her own stunts and sung live while doing so. We had a moment when I had to fly.